Ichimo here. I have refrained from reporting on the space combat experience in Star Citadel. It's an Alpha 30 PTU because it was just that bad. I could just not believe that Star Citizen release would release 30 Live with such a poor version of space combat, so I chose not to review it. They, however, proved me wrong. With the release of Live 30 to the world, they did just that. The same core functions that have been so bad since 3.0 was launched on the PTU are still in the live version. I am not talking about the bugs, which are many, nor about the lack of key bindings for most of your in-ship combat functions. I am stating that the flight mechanics of this game are maybe the worst flight mechanics of any game all time. Space combat is like your dog fighting on ice. Never feel you ever have control of your ships. It slips, it slides, and over controls on every axis. Nor are you able to adjust any of this in control settings. Joystick curves do not appear to do anything, same with saturation. No matter what you try to get a grip on ship movement, it pretty much will do what it wants, which means you cannot stay on target Firing when trying to pick up a target you constantly overshoot your marks. I realize everyone is going to state this is just alpha, but that is BS. This game has evolved around space combat, and they have bragged about Fire their off-delayed 3-0, acting like it would be amazing. How can it be amazing when the whole game is evolved around space combat, which is just beyond awful? So everyone who wants to claim it is just alpha, you are no doubt the same ones who have been claiming in the PTU just how bad it is. Star Citizen needed a good 3.0 live launch to bring disgruntled fans back on board. This release will most likely drive more people away.